University of Montevallo is widely considered one of the most beautiful campuses in Alabama, but long before becoming a beacon of academia, there is a history of wealth, death, and the supernatural. Our producer, Philip Onimus, shares a part of that story. Reynolds Hall served as a Civil War trauma center which came under siege during Wilson's raid. We have a theater at Reynolds Hall. They often uh, will say that they feel a presence and it's often thought of as an evil presence and they felt a cold wind at night uh, just sort of going by them. And then there are the stories of the unexplainable. The portrait of Captain Reynolds mysteriously keeps moving from room to room and place to place in Reynolds Hall. Across campus, there is King House. It's one of the oldest homes in central Alabama. It's here where Edmund King met his death, where his ghost is rumored to stay. The upstairs bedroom, um, students have said that there's often a strange light there and the curtains will move without anyone in King House. So what is it that ties this spirit to our world. He was quite wealthy and that, that was a little unusual. And so the legend is that he had some gold coins and he, the legend is that he buried the gold coins out in his peach orchard. He passed away in 1863 without telling anyone where he had buried these gold coins. He's merely an apparition who continues to protect what is his alone. Many, many reports of seeing uh, a, a, a strange light, uh, like a lantern. And many people have interpreted that as Mr. King with a shovel still searching for his gold coins. At the University of Montevallo, Philip Onimus, CBS 42 News. Ugh, creepy. All right, as we first mentioned, this is just part of the legend. Join us tomorrow at 10 to hear the story of the most chilling of the campus's ghost tales. Now that Philip has done a great job and just giving me the willies, and I think everybody at home the willies, is the weather going to chill us up or you, cool you, us? You know.